Hey everybody, I wanted to make a video directed towards Matt Monarch, David Wolf, and Daniel Vitalis. I'm sure you all know what it's about. It's about the deer antler and the placenta and the colostrum and the animal products that are being sold as health foods in the raw vegan industry, really. And uh, I've been f I've been following the story pretty closely. Everybody's it's replies and responses and reactions to the petition and protest really of the sales of these products and what I see is everybody Monarch, David Wolf and Vitalis sort of have a conscience about these things and they're defending them in a way that sort of says deep down that they know that it's not right. Deep down they know that the exploitation does not meet their compassion that they obviously have because they're you're all doing good work like I wouldn't be a raw foodist without David Wolf so I mean you guys mean the world to me really you guys have helped me out so much and I wanna thank you for everything you've done from the bottom of my heart because you've changed my life you have changed the way I look at things and it's been priceless to me really but um, there's some things that y'all are doing that I don't exactly agree with and hey, let me read this. this is something David Wolf has to say it says this is from longevity warehouse it says very few animal products are sold by longevity warehouse and these are from cruelty free environments that we have in many instances personally visited visited or sent someone we trust to visit where literally the highest care possible for animals and humans is observed and I'm going to show you some pictures. Uh, well, first of all, like, cruelty-free environment. Would you think it is cruel to be held captive your whole life and exploited for your body parts? Would you feel free and free of cruelty being held behind a fence your whole life and periodically had your teeth removed and sold on the market? Would you feel free if you were held in a cage and raped and had your child taken away and had your bodily fluids sucked out of you that is supposed to feed your child just so your owner and rapist can sell these products on the market? You know, is that does that sound like a cruelty-free environment? It's crazy, and even if, like, the deer antler is being harvested with painkillers it's still like having your whole life in a cage to go to the dentist and go on painkillers and have the dentist take your teeth out of you and sell them you may not feel the pain of it but you feel the pain of exploitation your whole life that's not what life is for we're not born to be exploited by others so just go with your conscience on this you obviously are good people and you're obviously trying to help but there's something going on here that is not helping and if it's being done just for money and and in the case of David Wolf and Matt Monarch you guys don't even use these products you obviously know that you don't need them so why are you selling them at high prices to other people the money's not worth it so please Follow your heart and your conscience and go with ethics, work with ethics and compassion and everything's going to be all right. You'll still have a big following, you'll still have people who support you for the good you do and you won't be supporting any cruelty and it's a win-win situation. So please, 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 please stop supporting this cruelty. Thank you.